When I first saw the mask, I remember only that I found it so frightening. But from where did this memory come? Already five years had passed since the defeat of Xiphos, the bringer of death. The world was at peace. But for me, that had little meaning. Avalonia was holding a fete to celebrate its fifth year of liberty. I think it's all over. It is now. And the winner is... Swordmaster Dow! <laughs> the passage of time has not dulled my blade or my skills. Are there no others? No more young heroes willing to challenge an old man? Aha! You there. The son of my accomplished pupil, Claymore, I believe. So, are you ready to try your hand against your father's master? Oh, blimey! An invite from Swordmaster Dow himself! He's only gonna challenge Claymore's son. Claymore, being one of the famous warriors, what defeated Xiphos, the Deathbringer! And what's more, he was a pupil of Swordmaster Dow, too! Goddess only knows what kind of match we're in for here! I have been speaking with your father. Tomorrow will be your 16th birthday, I hear. When a young man of our land comes of age, he must undertake the walk of the worthy. It is tradition. You must focus your mind and spirit on the ways of the sword now. Come, I will instruct you.
Yes, you are strong. You are well scented. You may even possess the inner tranquility required to execute the masterstroke technique I taught your father long ago. Do you wish to try? Father begets Tiger Son. You have inherited your father's command of the blade. Since Claymore lost his arm, he is no longer able to wield a sword. But you, the Kingdom of Avalonia, will be fortunate indeed to count you amongst its warriors. <laughs> the Royal Festival of Swordsmanship, commemorating the fifth anniversary of the defeat of Cyphus the Deathbringer! Go! Looked good out there, lad. Aye, that you did. Of course, old Dar was just playing with you, but if only I hadn't messed up my arm so badly, eh? Then I could have trained you up good and sharp, and maybe it would have been you playing with Dao. Ah, there you are. That last bout was quite a spectacle. I'm rather impressed. Prince Anlas, it's been a long time. You're a good deal tougher now than when you used to train under me, by the looks of it. 
Quite right. You'll find I never miss a day's training. So don't imagine you can outdo me just because you come from heroic stock. We should spar together sometime. Forgive me for asking, Your Highness, but uh, where's Queen Katana? I haven't seen Her Majesty all day. Mother is... I am told she has been feeling unwell in recent days. She confines herself to her chamber and refuses to see anyone, including myself. Hmm. I was thinking of dropping in and saying how do, but uh, maybe I'll save it for another time. Well, it'll be getting dark soon, son. Time to head home. Good to see you looking so well, Your Highness. You take care now. <laughs>